quick tip. It is regarding lip tars. They're by Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics and they're very long lasting lip products. Uh, they come in little tubes. I don't actually have a tube to show you because part of today was uh, a little tip to tell you that if they carry the OCC brand at your local Sephora and there's a color that you would like to try, you're not so sure if it's gonna look great on you. By the way, the colors are mixable, so you can mix a little bit of one color and a little bit of the other to kind of make a custom color for yourself. Now with that being said, it's probably one of the only lip products that you can take home to test out at Sephora because it's a squeeze tube, so they can squeeze a little bit out into their little containers. And this is what their little containers look like. So I had actually never tried Obsessive Compulsive. Um, I haven't tried anything from their line, and I'd never tried lip tars. So when I went into my Sephora, I saw them at the checkout counter, and I was like, hmm, you know, sounds kind of cool. Uh, I love matte lipsticks, but sometimes they dry me out. So I didn't know if I wanted to spend the 20 bucks to buy a tube. So um, my uh, local Sephora manager was like, well, just take some to try, you know, and she squeezed a little bit into this little pot. And um, so I said, all right. And then she said, well, this color might look good on you too. This one's called Vintage, and it's the one that I have on right now. And this one is called Super NSFW. I don't know why the uh, letters but it's more of like a reddish tone and it has some metallic that I could visibly see so I haven't tested this one out I haven't tried it on to see if I like it but anyway so I wanted to give you that little tip in case you want to try these types of lipsticks but you don't want to invest the $20 you don't know what color you might want um, you could try out different colors and then that way when you do go to purchase you know exactly what you're looking for and that's why I love Sephora Sephora is amazing and um, I also am going to show you how I apply it. I apply it, and this brush is dirty because this is the brush that I just applied it with. It is actually an eye brush by Essence of Beauty. It's um, pretty small, but I have big lips, so so my lips are large, so I can't use like a teeny, teeny, tiny brush, um, or I'll be there forever. And it took long enough as it is because I didn't want to mess up. Now I heard with these, if you mess up. Don't wipe out towards your face um, because it's hard to remove off the skin. So if you mess up, just like quickly wipe towards your mouth. So just wipe away. You're probably going to mess up around the edges the first time you do this because um, it's very easy to get out of line and you're not going to use a liner with this unless I suppose you could draw a liner on first to kind of follow the lines. I didn't. Um, so I messed up on the little part and I just like quickly put it in towards my lip and it was like no problem. So I just went back through it and fixed it up and it looks really good guys. It looks really good. It's like barely anything comes off when you tap it. I feel like it's still setting because I just put it on not too, too long ago. And um, you know, use a brush according to your lip size. Mine's a little bit bigger. My lips are bigger. Um, let me see an average size lip brush. It's probably a little bit smaller. It's a lot smaller. That's kind of embarrassing. That's a lot smaller. This is like your average lip brush that comes with a lip product usually. So anyway, just use whatever you're comfortable with. And then I'm going to insert a clip of how I applied it. demo. It's um, a fun way to try out a new product without spending any money at first because it is a little bit of an investment. The tubes are not that large. They're about that big but they last forever because you only need a tiny little drop. Concentrate on the center of your lips and then work your way out and you'll be good. So uh, go to your Sephora, pick up a sample, try one of these beautiful colors. There's one that um, I want to try but my Sephora didn't have it and it's called either Black Dahlia or Dahlia and it is so gorgeous for fall and winter. It's like black, it's almost black. It looks black in the tube, but it's not. It's like a really deep, deep, deep color on your lips though. It's really gorgeous. So anyway, I might try that one next. Have a great day and take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.